the best show we would see every year would be Ted Nugent. And on this night, the Nuge has an opening band called Van Halen. And so Van Halen runs out on stage and they play a few songs. None of them suck. Everyone goes like, wow, that was pretty damn good. Who are they? And a few songs in, the singer starts talking and he seems to be like a peroxided Mark Twain. He can really turn a phrase and it becomes evident that the singer in the band doesn't seem to understand that we're not all there to see him. And he doesn't seem to know that he's in the opening band. It seems to be that he's in the headlining band and we're all there. It's nice to be back in Largo, Maryland. Nice to be back. He's never been here before. What the fuck is he talking about? But it was awesome. And a few songs in after that, uh, the band runs off stage with the exception of Eddie Van Halen, who comes to the front of the stage and delivers uh, uh, unto all of us uh, Eruption, this big solo from the first album. And he does this amazing thing and he comes to the end of it and he stands in front of all of us and he holds his hands up and looks at them like I can't believe these things look at them will ya and he steps back from where he was standing and looks at where he was just standing like he was now looking at his aura he's now looking at himself in the third person James Brown used to say jump back I gotta kiss myself that's what Eddie Van Halen was doing he's just like damn and if it was anyone else doing anything less amazing, everyone would have like thrown chairs at him. But all you heard after he did the solo was 18,000 jaws go because it was pretty damn amazing. And then everyone kind of went, oh yes, whoa, huge applause. The band runs back on stage and they finish the set and everyone kind of looked at each other and went, well, geez, that was a pretty strong opening band. Like, wow, that was cool.